groups uh, of usually uh, youth movement. Mm. Uh, they, they come for uh, one week to two months and stay with us, work with us, learn a little. Mm. Uh, young adults uh, serve here one year before the army, the lady army, and uh, volunteer here for one year and take care of the maintenance and guarding and gardening and uh, cooking and. Uh, all the, all the things that the farm needs um, and then we have uh, the eco-israel program at the age of 18 to 30 they um they come here in uh, masab and the uh, masab uh, program it's a uh, five months to one year uh, stay in israel and they live uh, here in the uh, in the domes and yurts uh, for five months and become to be one of the family one of the Right now they are in a trip, they have three trips uh, every semester, one to the north, one to the south and one to Jerusalem, it's a hiking trip and they uh, have the opportunity to see Israel not in a touristic way but in a um, more local way and the trips are different, they uh, reach uh, another communities and sometimes they volunteer or just um, visit them. Also manage our water. Use the, also the rainwater. We have uh, big containers uh, next to each uh, building. See over there also. Mm. Uh, this uh, attached to the roof, and the rainwater goes into these containers, and then it goes to a big pool, and mm. then with a pump, we we send it wherever we want. Take care of the grey water, which is uh, water that come out from uh, showers and uh, washing dishes. Uh, so water that uh, come out of the uh, um, thing uh, go through a few filters that clean the water. At the end, the water goes through this uh, rock pool. It's also part of the of the cleaning. And uh, this is. Uh, clean live water you can see that we have fish and frogs and um, turtles and flowers mm. bees are coming and uh, and birds so it's not a drinking water for human but it's really full of life and when it's um when it's loaded then we take the water to uh, another direction when it's full we can, uh, water the, the beds or give it back to nature if needed and also we have the compost toilet, I don't know if you use the toilet, but we don't have a regular toilet, so it's a compost toilet with a different method. All the energy in the farm is uh, solar energy. We've got a small panel that uh, tracks the sun. So it turns so in the morning facing there and during the day it's collect them um, as much sun as needed or possible turn all the way facing there in the evening and then when the sun set it's turned back and wait for the sunrise
show all kind of uh, way to compost and the process. Uh, this is a red worm. Do you know the red worm compost? There is a, um, a, a creature called a uh, red worm that uh, they eat everything and we use the, the food. This is how you um, use water for composting. Yeah, well, yeah. center where we um, the things that grow for the center in the in the fields mm -hmm. uh, cut and, and dried here all kind of soaps natural soaps uh, magic ointment and it's good for all kind of the uh, skin irritation and tea blends Take um, at I think at least one month to dry the soap. Oh, two weeks to one month to, to dry and then you can use it. We try to use this uh, organic soaps uh, here everywhere. We use the water again, so we want uh, all our uh, cleaning products are uh, ecological. So this is the. The mud building uh, center. This whole building made of uh, local materials, local mud, soil. So some of it is uh, for art, uh, mm -hmm. and like you use clay, uh, and some is uh, more serious or usable things. Uh, Samples of uh, of mud or soil from everywhere. Some places in uh, this is from Morocco, and this is from some places in uh, in the desert or uh, uh, in Tel Aviv, Tel Aviv or yeah. from uh, Greece. This is from Greece, Thailand. Uh, also, when we have festivals, and we do, uh, we have. Um, activity um, makeup from okay. uh, natural colors mm -hmm. so we make it from all kind of uh, rocks oh. and uh, minerals mm -hmm. uh, and it, there is a variety of uh, colors it's really nice last um, week we just finished uh, a course to teach people how to build their own house. So this is the um, this is the all kind of technique of building and uh, plaster and uh, decoration. And the next course will be how to make the straw roof. So a lot of people touch it, and each one give his own uh, inspiring way. So the Hava and Adam Ecological Institute have zero waste. They take every bit of trash that comes into the place via their students or their visitors. They put it into a big recycling center and they figure out how to make something out of it. Whether it's the inner walls of the cob buildings or whether carpets made out of t-shirts or flip-flops made out of plastic. They recycle every single piece of garbage, so they're completely zero waste. They just made it today. It's a mobile, uh, made of uh, natural materials and reuse materials. You can't touch that, you can you? Most of the stuff here is um, 
things that uh, instead of throwing it to the garbage, we try to open our mind and reuse it for art and craft, uh, some time for building, as you see the, the bottles here. This is from uh, plastic bags. This is from the plastic bags. This is a home accessory. And um, from this uh, t-shirt, we made this uh, carpet. It's uh, a chicken and a net. Mm. This is the, the, the base. You just need to tie it so kids can do it. Nobody can mess it, mm -hmm. and it's almost done, yeah. and it's really nice. We always have lunch together at one o'clock, the entire community and all the people that are uh, in the farm at that moment. Okay, so we cook uh, fresh food, mainly uh, picked from the, from the field, and we take turns on the cooking. Uh, and everybody at one o'clock sharp, we have uh, lunch here. Uh, but the people that live uh, on the farm uh, have uh, breakfast and dinner also for themselves. This is a pizza uh, oven. This is uh, with the open fire. Okay, you put the wood inside and then you uh, put a pizza or basically for pizza. But uh, every day. Uh, Yeah, it's hot. It's a color. This is um, a yeah. quinoa, quinoa and yeah. cucumber yeah. salad. Yeah. And you can see some uh, baby carrots here. And beets. And yes. mash uh, beans with uh, vegetables and moringa. Marina yeah. trees? Yes, we do. Careful. This is a squash. Spaghetti squash from the farm. for our next episode where we're going to be visiting a farm in the middle of the desert in Israel. They desalinate their water and they provide a quarter of the electricity to the city of Elat.